Hello everyone. In this video we are going to show you how to add a subdomain with SSL on Amazon AWS. EC2 instance. So let's start. In first step, we are going to create a subdomain from our domain name providers dashboard. We are going to add a a record where host is the name of out subdomain in my case it is demo and value for this host is IP address that I collected from AWS control panel earlier. After adding the A record we are going to add inbound rules for HTTPS to our security group. Without adding this inbound rule we can't access the HTTPS content when we will deploy SSL to out server. In the next few steps we are going to set up virtual host for our subdomain. All the commands will be in the description box. At first we are going to create directory for our subdomain and manage their permission. After that we are going to create an index file inside our subdomain. After create the index file we need to set up a config file for our virtual host. When we try to access our subdomain from internet browser it will point to our server then the virtual host will point to the right folder. After creating the config file and add the content to it we need to enable the new virtual host file. When we are finished, we need to restart Apache to make these changes take effect. Here we can see that our subdomain is working perfectly. Next step is obtain SSL for our subdomain. For using Let's Encrypt to obtain an SSL certificate you need to install the CertBot software on your server.
If you have the EU firewall enabled, as recommended by the prerequisite guides, you'll need to adjust the settings to allow for HTTPS and SSH traffic. Luckily, Apache registers a few profiles with you for upon installation. After that we are going to obtain SSL by using CertBot. CertBot provides a variety of ways to obtain SSL certificates through plugins. The Apache plugin will take care of reconfiguring Apache and reloading the config whenever necessary. After CertBot issue the SSL certificate we can visit our subdomain securely from HTTPS. Here we can see that HTTPS is working perfectly.